PGT Beauregard commanded the defenses of Charleston, South Carolina for the start of the Civil War at Fort Sumter on April 12, 1861. Three months later, he was the victor at the First Battle of Bull Run. Beauregard commanded armies in the Western Theater, including the Battle of Shiloh in Tennessee and the Siege of Corinth in northern Mississippi. He returned to Charleston and defended it from repeated naval assaults and land attacks in 1863. In June 1864, Beauregard saved the city of Petersburg, Virginia, and thus also the Confederate capital of Richmond from assaults by an overwhelmingly superior Union Army force. However, his influence over Confederate strategy was marred by his poor relationships with Confederate President Jefferson Davis and other generals. In April 1865, Beauregard and his commander, Joseph E. Johnston, convinced Davis and the remaining cabinet members that the war needed to end, and the majority of the remaining Confederate armies were surrendering to Sherman. He died in 1893 and is buried in New Orleans in a tomb of the Army of Tennessee.